What is happening guys, it's Alan here from the Dangleberries and as promised I have a brand new tips and tricks video for you here today. Now just before I jump into the video I want to let you know that I stream over on Twitch every single day. So if you want to jump in, chill out, play some games on PC or PS4, drop down into the link in the description and go over and drop the channel a follow. I'll be streaming over there a little bit later on tonight. So without me talking anymore guys, let's dive in and check out that first tip. So this first trick guys takes us over onto cafe and this is an amazing c4 spot that was shown to me by donut or six make sure to check out his links they're down in the description now this c4 spot is located on the third floor inside the cigar shop now all you have to do is where the hatch is located make sure to break open the hatch and the entire wall looking out towards the red staircase now all you have to do is drop down below the hatch and stand up against the wall in front of you now turn around and look up back through the hatch and aim down sights looking at where the wall meets the ceiling make sure to aim exactly the way I'm looking on screen and you may need to practice this in some custom games to get it right but once you have found the right spot that I'm using you need to slowly walk forward as you're throwing the C4 and it will go up through those shelves and out into Red Stairs hallway. Now anyone dropping down from that hatch will be in for a big surprise when they get caught by that C4 on Red Stairs. So staying on cafe here guys for this next trick and this one is also located on the third floor inside the cocktail lounge. Now all you have to do is reinforce the two walls that are on the east side wall of the bar and then make sure to shoot out the top just above the reinforcement where there's a small little gap in the wall. Now on the other side inside the cocktail lounge you can jump up on the small counter where the chandelier is hanging from the ceiling. Now from up here you'll be able to throw smoke canisters through the top of that reinforced wall over towards the default plant spot and just by the bar counter also into the cigar shop and also over towards the new hatch. Once you're up on top of this countertop guys, make sure to aim in between the chandelier lights on top and aim the crosshair right between the reinforcement and the ceiling above. Moving on to the next trick guys and this one takes us over onto fortress now this is a little bit of a hiding spot that you can use down in the kitchen on the first floor now whether the bomb site is in the kitchen or not it's still a really nice spot to use to catch out enemies who are pushing this side or just pushing through that general direction they will not expect you to be sitting up on this shelf in the corner now what you have to do is shoot the two shelves on the right and the top shelf on the left and make sure to shoot the cereal boxes and the can that is sitting on that last shelf now all you have to do is vault up on the countertop and run around on top of the bags and you'll be able to walk across on top of this shelf and hide up behind the meat that's hanging in the corner. the next trick guys and this one takes us over onto clubhouse now this is located on the first floor in the stock room this is an amazing little hiding spot that you can catch anyone coming off that warehouse spawn and pushing into that room now all you have to do here guys is break the two containers on the right hand side and then break all the containers in the back corner of the wall then you'll be able to prone and crawl up to the side of the small container that's left on the ground and you'll be able to get up inside that back corner now make sure to prone drop and get down underneath that slab of beers and you'll be completely hidden from any enemy pushing into the room.
Moving on to the next trick guys, this one was shown to me by Amphi. Make sure to check him out, his link will be down in the description. Now this is an amazing little pixel peek that you can use to catch anyone trying to get a spawn kill off of that dragon wall window. All you have to do is stand next to the tower itself as you can see on screen and just underneath that little half roof and the wall there is a small little gap in between it. So just before I let you go guys, if you have a tip or trick that you want featured in one of my videos, drop down into my Discord, the link is down in the description, and drop a message to me in there or in the Siege Tips section on my Discord. Keep up to date on all my social medias, they are also linked down below. And if you're new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you know when we upload our next video. And as always, yeah.